How to prevent image hotlinking for Joomla using FTP. Hotlink protection prevents other websites from linking to your images and files and thereby stealing your bandwidth. Let's find out how to manually enable it just for your Joomla directory. This tutorial is intended for servers that do not have cPanel or some other control panel installed or that have a control panel that does not allow you to automatically add hotlink protection to your site. Your website must be on a server that runs Apache Web Server with Mod Rewrite installed. First, we'll need to create a new text document. Right-click in Windows Explorer. Go to New. Then, click Text Document. Name the file htaccess.txt and press Enter. Double-click to open the file with Notepad. Here, we'll need to type several lines of code that will determine which website should be allowed to hotlink to your files, which types of files the hotlinking restrictions should be imposed upon, as well as some related options. First, type Rewrite Engine On. This enables Mod Rewrite, which lets us control what Apache does with the URL it receives. From here on, follow along with the typing and pause as needed. Be sure to type exactly what you see, simply replacing yourdomain.com with your domain name. Note that this is an intentional misspelling of the word referrer dating back to the origins of the web. It is not a typo. When a request for a file is sent to a web server, a number of headers are sent from your browser. One of these is known as the referrer. Referrers are sent in two cases, when a web page loads an image or other type of file as part of its contents, and when someone follows a link on a page. This last part is key. It tells Apache to allow access to any request whose referrer starts exactly with HTTP www.yourdomain.com. NC stands for no case, which means the referrer specified is not case sensitive. In other words, this line will match any combination of uppercase and lowercase letters. Now, we need to specify which file extensions to apply the referrer restrictions to. Change the extensions specified here to whichever ones you want. Just separate them with the pipe symbol which can typically be typed by pressing the Shift key along with backslash. This is the URL someone will be redirected to if they trigger the hotlink protection. The R stands for Forced Redirect. Replace it with an F and remove the URL portion of this line if you would rather force a 403 forbidden error to be displayed. Next, Let's add a few more lines to finish giving access to yourdomain.com. Press Ctrl plus C to copy. Press Enter, then Ctrl plus V to paste. Delete the last part of the URL to allow the home page, without a trailing slash or anything after the domain name, to have access to your protected files. Now, copy and paste this part as before. Remove www from the two new lines. Both yourdomain.com and its www subdomain have been set up. Currently, the only way people will be able to access your protected files will be through yourdomain.com. 
Even manually typing the URL for one of your files won't work. Let's fix that. This does what we want by making the referrer optional. Manually entered URLs have no referrer. There are no letters in this referrer now, so NC is not needed and can be deleted. Let's add another domain name to the list. Copy and paste all four lines we typed for yourdomain.com. Now, press Ctrl plus H to find and replace yourdomain.com with demo1234.com for just these four newest lines. Press Replace until all four lines have been updated with the second domain. Click Cancel. Repeat these steps for as many domain names as you want. Press Ctrl plus S to save the file. Now that the .htaccess file is complete, it's time to upload the file to the Joomla directory using FTP. For this tutorial, we'll be using FileZilla to access our FTP server. You can use whichever program you want. Joomla provides you with an htaccess.txt file that you can choose to use, so let's find that one and rename it in case you decide to use it in the future. Now, drag and drop the file we created to the Joomla directory on your server and scroll up to find it. Right click and rename it to .htaccess. Windows would not have allowed us to name it this. Phew, that was a lot of work. But, now you know how to prevent people from hotlinking to files on your Joomla site.